In San Antonio, they're asking for winter weather gear. Rescue teams in Turkey are still searching through the rubble looking for survivors after two powerful earthquakes destroyed thousands of buildings along the Turkey-Syria border. The cold weather impacting search efforts, and that's why the American Turkish Association of San Antonio is collecting winter gear right now at La Madeline off of 281. That's where we find our Camelia Juarez. Camelia, what kind of donations are they asking for and what have been collected so far? Steve, just take a look behind me. I mean, this is how many donations are being helped, given out. It's an 18-wheeler that is soon to be full of coats, jackets, hygiene gear, and a lot of these items are new. Now, the weather is freezing in Turkey, which makes it tough for search teams and survivors. So we've seen bags of beanies and gloves. All the items collected here at La Madeline will be sent to the Turkish General Consulate in Houston, who will then send it to those in, in need. Malik Yanis with the American Turkish Association of San Antonio says they're so grateful for the support so far. Wonderful to get this much support. This is kind of at the same time, it's a little bit beginning, so we will ask for them to support us more, you know, like uh, monetary donations, especially needed. Now, monetary donations can be sent through the American Turkish Association. We do have a link to that on our website. Also, the Raindrop Foundation is having a prayer service tonight at 630 at 4337 Vance Jackson. There, they will also be accepting donations like we see behind us. Reporting live from the north side, Camelia Juarez, KSAT 12 News. Keep up to date with all of San Antonio's top news, weather, and so much more by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below. And once again, thanks for watching KSAT.